Well, as you know, the political climate around the country has been contentious, to say the least. Mm -hmm. Protests started after the election and have really continued since mm. President Trump's inauguration. Paul Nelson joins us live in the newsroom after speaking with a political expert about this very topic. Paul? Yeah, Kristen, the political division in this country is alive and well, but at the same time, it's nothing new. While many are angry about the election of President Trump, we've seen some of that anger get shifted to Republican members of Congress, including right here in Nevada. That's not we'll see. Is we'll see how we I agree with that. The Affordable Care Act is killing the country. No. 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 This Carson City Chamber of Commerce luncheon turned into a heated town hall meeting two days ago, where some in the crowd booed, yelled, and interrupted Senator Dean Heller and Congressman Mark Amaday. Be fair to everybody else here in this room. This type of thing has been happening all over the country, where Democrats, for the most part, are confronting Republican leaders. They're showing up, they're loud, they're angry, and many of these elected officials really don't know how to cope with it. Herzig says this type of thing is nothing new, comparing it to the Tea Party movement from early in Barack Obama's presidency. You've got people don't like the election, don't like the direction, don't like the other side, and it's just a, it's a bad stew. Many demanded that Heller hold a town hall meeting, and you could say they made that happen at this luncheon. That didn't sit well with others on hand. You guys are the rudest bunch of people, those exactly. yelling and interrupting. My wife's upset, we're going to leave. I wish you could be a little more adult and a little more courteous. Whether Republicans and Democrats can meet a little closer to the middle remains to be seen, but that might depend on the policies set in the next couple of years. It's either going to work or the Democrats have to, in a sense, channel this anger at a town hall into getting voters to turn out. Heller and Amade did get a chance to talk about what they want to do with things like health care, immigration, and the economy. And we did talk to Amade afterwards. He says the Congress as a whole hasn't gotten much done, and it needs to do a better job. Covering the story live in the newsroom, Paul Nelson, Channel 2 News. Now.